Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that were posted on Tuesday, 13th of June 2023. The next few trades were shared by MG, who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. As you see, his macro chart is in sideways, but it's showing going down with red candle. You can see that in a structural one minute chart as a downtrend channel that gained momentum. Then using a smaller trading time frame of 20 seconds, he identified multiple area of pullbacks and entered here, mostly set up T with sell short positions and closed this with profit. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by AA who's trading NASDAQ CFD. As you see, the macro chart is in sideways, range expanding and uh, buyers are pushing the price higher. So we can see that in a structural chart as an uptrend. So using a smaller trading tick chart, he identified the area of pullback and entered and managed this with profit using exit strategy number one. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Ren or global instructor and programmer who's trading S&P 500 CFD. As you see, the structural and macro is in uptrend and you can see that channel on one minute chart. So you can see that in one minute trading chart, we have these channels that are aligned with the higher time frame that creates high probability trading area. So I entered here based on algo one to five, another pullback happened here and entered again. And also with very good risk to reward ratio, managed this trade and close it with profit. Then again, we had a complex pullback that it went down and tested this dynamic support area and the price got rejected. So again, this channel is aligned with the higher time frames. And when the pullback got completed here, he entered here with good risk to reward ratio and closed this one also with profit. So thank you, Rain, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan, or global instructor, who's trading NASDAQ futures. As you see, the macro chart is in wide range sideways, but the price is going down. And we can see the red candles that pass this dynamic support area so you can see the downtrend channel here that is gaining momentum in the structural chart so using 10 second trading chart he identified multiple area of sell short and entered here three positions based on algo one to five and managed this uh, with exit strategy number one and also active management of the trades with profit so the result of these trades shows that he reached profit factor of 99, which is infinite because he had 100% win rate and his average winning trades were 296 and the largest winning trade was $360. So thank you, Jan, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm gonna replay the video here for you. Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you my trades taken today on Tuesday, 13th of June 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ and also Russell and Dow Jones Industrial Average Futures. If you look at the market hourly macro chart, we see that during the Globex session, the price went up on the NASDAQ and tested this point of control and it got rejected and went down during the London session and retested again the previous day high and also close. This got rejected. So during the New York market session, when the market opened at 930, the price was at this area of point of control and it was wide range sideways and going up above this point of control and Again, going down sideways, and I took these with the setup B. You can see entry and exits on the NASDAQ and also on the Russell. And the YM was more trendy. As you see, these three candles here, I took these candles long position on the YM. And you see the entry and exits. So these signals from the three charts were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funding accounts. And the result is showing average profit factor of 1.69 with 73% win rate from the long trades that were taken with the average win to loss ratio of 0.62. The largest winning trade was 1,155 and the largest losing trade was $554.
So hope this trace taken by the PATH system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.